It's the very same as a vineyard. You know, you start off with your roots at the bottom and they grow up, they shoot up in early summer and then the cones come on them around the midsummer and then it, we're waiting for the, the last maybe 10, about 10 days to go. What we're waiting for here is the flower to actually close. Once the flower has closed, we're ready to go. Let's but pull one of them off there. We're actually looking for now. It's right in the center of this. You can see the yellow, almost like a pollen. There is a resin and an oil. And that oil is what contains the bitterness, which is what we want for our beer. So that's incredible. Of, of the hops plants that we see here, it's all about these. Yes. Um, and then what's in these is just a bit of dust, really. And yes. within that dust is an oil. Is an oil. And that's which, what's used for our beer. Exactly. And what we do is we actually put these in at the beginning of the boil. And it takes about 60 minutes for the oil to dissolve into the beer, which creates the bitterness. And there's a whole variety of different types of hops, which give different types of oil flavours different types of aromas. So this is just one particular variety here, which as you can see, believe it or not, is only a dwarf variety. Uh, the usual hop variety goes through about 17 feet. And hops is all about bitterness. All about bitterness. They also have preservative quality. The bitter your beer, the longer it will last. The English used to make a famous beer years ago called Indian Pale Ale, where they, had, they triple hopped it to make it survive the long journey to, the, to India for the troops. It became known as a very, very hoppy beer, but that's what it's all about. We have 400 plants here, which uh, will be sufficient for our needs for the next few years, but it'll also teach us about hops, about hop growing, about the problems that are associated with it, and learn. We have made mistakes, there's no doubt about that, but that's the good part about it. You learn from your mistakes and you, 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 you get in touch with your plants, you get in touch with the ingredients that we're actually making beer. How much beer in bottles will all this make? You'd be looking at about a hundred thousand bottles. A hundred thousand. Thousand bottles. It's extraordinary. Yeah. It's extraordinary. Yeah, such a small area you can give. Um, and this is only our first growing season. Next year we'll have. The, it's, it's all about the rootstock this year. Next year it'll all be about the, the cones themselves, in terms of viability and the actual the amount of lupulin that's inside in each cone.